who just went hatch first and a ZBZ. And we have Dead Game, who also went hatch first and a ZBZ. He's a blue Zerg. And we see Gatsby for pool, which would indicate some very fast speedling. At this point, I would say speedling. Because Bailing's too far out yet to tell. But I can see Speedling's being some a little bit early here. Now, guess it from Panda Bear Me. And remember, right, Panda Bear Me qualified for a Rival Star League as well, so congrats to him. I didn't see him play at all, though, so I'm not sure exactly what or who he beat and all. I can't remember anymore. If I remember right, he did play. He lit some GMs and he beat them. I'm not sure what the GM names were, but he did play very well to qualify. And I was happy who qualified in that over like 64 players. So. Pretty good. Guess is finished for Panda Bear Me, and Dead Game does have his guess finish as well. So that's we should be starting any second here from Dead Game. Queen is coming out from his natural. We see over chase going on here. Always uh, interesting to see. Needs to say it is a very slow paced tag or game of yeah, that was a tag. I'll show you another word, but I can't think of any other word that would. Might be better than tag, so tag would be the best one. Uh, the Panda Meat still have guys in gas. Uh, he should pull out two guys and keep one in gas for banelings. We see no guys in gas from day game, so he won't be going. He won't be having a bailing follow up with this. It is be straight up speed. This old word will probably end up dying here. I would think. Er, no, queen too slow. So never mind. He'll be okay. Our uh, day game here is he's just he's not yes he beef nation is not making any zerglings but speed is going to be done in those zerglings yet unless that round's going to be f or no being round of drones not sure why he had speed so early then if he's not going to use it. Right now, I believe Ryman. No, Pen Foster's up one game, and it looks like Panamere does scout. And he does see a gas. People in gas. He did see the natural gases as well, so he will expect some really uh, tech going on here. Yeah, Panamere. His layer is almost done. He has a halfway done, so that's going to be really troublesome for a dead game as his layer's going to be a little bit behind. And I'm not sure what is going to do with that layer though. As he doesn't have any roach run up just yet. So he could do some kind of like roach attack. And Panabermi is a. Uh, that's what attack is going on for. <gasps> Excuse me. Ugh. The game is getting close on attack. Missile attacks, rather. And we see Panda Bear Me, though. He's getting plus one attacks and he's getting a God Reconstruction, so we all have that speed roach going on. So we'll probably, probably will end up seeing the aggression from Panda Bear Me. I would imagine because it would make sense. Drone is saved. Thank God for the drone. The game, though, he is. Uh, has good amount of roaches, though. He's going to need a little bit more, though. And his scout construction is a little bit slower than what Panabrimi is. So Panabrimi will be able to like, snipe uh, that third more than likely. I would say he will be able to snipe that pretty easily too. With the speed being done before dead game. <sighs> it's been a well since I actually casted something. It's been like a good month. Because I've been busy with taking finals from school. And then we got... I was aiming from CB Rush and all that good stuff. Lucky me. Apparently, he's not doing his roaches just yet. He is hitting them with them. I, I like to see aggression from the two. Because it would make sense. And he's going to do some aggression right now. Nah. 
kind of me. He, it's, he was going for any of his retreats. I'm not sure what was going on. Maybe he got scared of the Roche Count from Dead Game. And he decided to fall back home. It'd be worth his time to actually go and be aggressive against it. Did I just hit tab? Did I hit, did I hit tab for that? Oh, I did. That was one of these. Oh, tab the. Alright. Okay. That's what I did. I hit tab to bring up the. I see. I see. By the way, I should probably do this. Kind of me. Nope. There we go. Got to do that. You know, it's the give them the one uh, kill. We do have dead game now. He is doing. I I'm not sure what his goal is here. He's not really getting anything done. He's gonna go to the rocks, maybe. I I'm still not sure what he plans to do with it. I mean, there's not much he can do with it. He's gonna break down the rocks once more. And he does see this. And Penabermi is going to try to find him and take him down, looks like. Looks like I'm seeing a really straight macro game here. Each player is waiting for one of them to slip up. And right now we do have dead game. Uh, he does find some roaches to see where the army's at. Or, it looks like a miss rally almost. Penabermi, though, he is going to use, uh, clean out some zerglings here and there, but nothing all too major. Meanwhile, on the back of the list, we have Dead Game, does have his lair finished. Uh, no tech yet from that. No Spire, no Infesting Pit, no nothing, no Hydra. And I like to see some Hydras out from one of the players. I feel like it would be a great benefit to both. Well, not really both, but from one of them against the other person. If that makes any sense. It was engaging he would uncle down at the ramp between the left field of the fourth maybe. Fourth or fifth ish. And we do see Panamari trying to take down the rocks here from Dead Game. Dead Game's gonna go up above though. He's gonna he's gonna realize this and he's gonna go up above. He's gonna try to get a nice concave. But Panamber me though, uh not really sure what he was doing there. I feel like Dead Game could have got a couple uh shots off with those roaches of his. Oh no, he catches the roaches on transition out to the uh, main. He looks like Dick, or not Dick. <laughs> Penaver, he does get a nice concave here on the ramp. And now the roaches can fire here. He's taking away a lot of roaches. Dead game is bringing 12 more roaches in the back of this. And plus 2 attack is almost done. Nice concave from Panabermi. Me. Panabermi me taking a lot of losses though. The very far from Dead game are way too strong. And we see Dead game does conclude this up pretty easily. And. Not really take a whole lot of losses here, but he should be looking this up. Or not. I was wrong. Caster's wrong. Caster's wrong. Big Frozen's from Pandaberry were very strong. Even though Pan that game does have plus two, he is still losing the battle, which is quite surprising. It the amount of macro that Pandaberry does have behind this. And the third saturation for him is just amazing. If you look up here real quick, he does have it nice and saturated. But this engagement is still going on. Dead game is slowly pushing this horses back. But looking for the front panel, we do arrive. And we are s still having a bunch of assets around each other. I don't think it takes like a beach wall or something that's gonna throw at each other. GG is called. Panamber me takes game number two. Number two. Alright. Let me get over here. Out of game. The music going, Monster Cat.
Alright, we are back. And I got the right over here this time. I was going to push my other one, but that is my team essential stuff on it, and that won't be very good. It's supposed to be on. That's the whole point. And if it wasn't on, I'd be kind of worried. Really, really worried. Because means I can't, casting it seems kind of counterintuitive that way. Anyways, by my corner map, we have from, from Redmond. Yeah, Redmond. He's a very own dead saint. He's a teal Zerg player. And top of the map we have from Penn Foster. Er, no. Have I set up? I think I messed that up. Hmm. I hate Zergs. Uh, hang on. I gotta figure out what teams they're from. Because I'm pretty sure I got that right though. Hope I did. And if I didn't, well, if I get out of this, there we go. All right, we have Livermore. Hey, right, he is from Livermore. I was right. I was right. Dead Saint is from Livermore, so I wasn't wrong. That game is from him, like I was last game. I just derped really hard. Now easy easy though. You guys get your sh uh, fair share of Zergs today. ZUZ action. And I believe if uh, the game wins this one, or not the game, if Dead Saint wins this one, he does take home, or they do move on to the next uh, round. I'm not sure what round this is. I think it's like a second round of playoffs. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this is the second round of playoffs. And they would play either Sohegan, which is a John Snow school, or Walnut, which has, I think that's intense. Yeah, I think Walnut has intense on it. And someone else. Intense and, uh, what else is the name? Um. I can't think of his name. You know, I'll probably think of it later. Pro Killer? Or something like that? Just need a gas before pool, so that's always, uh, nice to see. A little, uh, aggression going on here. And, had Natural is halfway done for Dead Game. Same below for both of these players. Nothing really different from either of them. One's a faster guy, but it doesn't really mean a whole lot. I got the chat here. Talk to you guys. Anyway, I got this. I got this. It's been a while, but I should remember the names, hopefully. And if I figured, Valerie, you seem like you're someone who's uh, playing in these, so she'll tell me if I. If one, well, I'm pretty sure if Dead Saint wins this one, they don't have to finish out the series. Or at least still finish out series. I ask. Uh, I don't think they do, but who knows? I think the parents still have to play the whole series out if Dead Saint does win, because. Anyway, speed is almost done. Do you see Dead Saint is still like, kicking in some gas here? So I will see roaches or banning us go down for him. Do you see banning us getting thrown on? As I did say that, and I, it was in the production tab already. Go figure. But yeah, it was in there. And we do see a banning us coming out for Dead Saint. Now for Dead Game, though, no, no banning us, no roach horn. If he scouts banning us, he should have been on one of his own. Or roach horn, I would. I would. Hmm. I think a roach horn would be better for him if he did scout it now. Did he see it? He didn't even see it yet. I think he's too scared to lose the Overlord because of the Queen that says not at the natural. Which would make sense. The game is so has a nice uh natural nice and uh saturated there. No gas hit and you just put guys back on gas, so we'll probably see some tech game thrown down here. No natural gases natural gases are taken, but nothing mining on them. Did you see a roach run thrown on two evil three evil chambers? 
Is he getting prepped for an all-in? Looks like he is. He did see a bunch of zerglings outside his main base. And it looks like they're gonna, gonna head and just cham away at this I think it's a bailing us or no, it's a ro evil chamber. What is that? That's a roach one, okay. It looks like the things do get in there, and we'll see it. So they're going to the natural mana lane. But I guess are going to be in there. We see some nice that nations off. Oh, I actually actually went to wasted that many bailings on the drones, but hey, he still got a lot of drones, and it's it. <laughs> and that's game. Dead Saint it does take the win, and we see uh, Livermore, Pen Foster, and, well slash Livermore and Pen Foster, Livermore and Pen Foster move on to the next round. And I don't know if they're gonna play out the series. I will go over here, or maybe now since I hit the StarCraft thing. There we are. Right, Lee gentlemen, that is it for me here today with like literally thirty or twenty minutes of uh, entertainment. Thank you for tuning in, all of you. And if you guys watched this bod, great games. Fan me, congrats on uh making it into the RSL. AK Rel Starcraft League. Again, congrats, that's a pretty good accomplishment to have. Uh what else is there? Follow uh thanks for the sponsors, Twitch New Egg, Rocat, MSI, Blizzard, Jinx, uh missing someone. Who am I missing? No, that should be everyone. Yeah, I think that's all the sponsors. Uh, like us on Facebook slash HS Star League. Facebook.com slash HS Star League. Anyway, it's on the overlay. If you can see it, like below my name. Uh, follow me on Twitter at TSA Vampyrworm. If you choose to do so, if you don't, that's okay. I don't swear that much anyway. But if you do, thank you. Uh, follow me on Twitch, Twitch TV slash Vampyrworm as well. Since I, I actually did stream before this, I was in a tournament and I lost. And I do that bad though I lost some new skills, so it's all worth it. Uh, oh yeah, Twitter. Uh, I think it's. Is this a slash H S L A two on Twitter? I think it is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Let's see an overlay. Derp. But thanks for watching, everyone. Hope we'll to see you next time. We'll see you actually tomorrow, I believe. I'll be back on, hopefully with some replays. And if there's no replays, then I guess I won't be on because let's be kind of dumb to have a cast with no replays. Or live games for that matter. But thanks for tuning in. See you guys next time. Peace.